In this screencast I'll show you how to supply data to the source and sync units in your dynamic simulation. So first of all on the source double click to enter the data and we're going to set some parameters in here. We need the thermal condition, the pressure and the temperature for the source and we'll set these as 3550 KPA gauge for the pressure and 395 Kelvin for the temperature. Then we also need to specify the components. So for the ethylene, we'll say that that's three, and then that's in a ratio of to two, to four, to two, and once we click apply, these are now stored and and, Pro, and DynSim will normalize these. And then on the thermal, we can specify whether we only want to do the vapor calculations, the liquid only. Uh, we'll just stick to the default there, click apply, click OK. And then that is the information for the source specified. For the sink, again we double click and all we have to specify here is a pressure. So in this example at the moment we'll just set this to be a pressure of 200 kPa gauge. And that is how you can supply source and sink data to your simulation.